Drivers, cyclists and pedestrians in town yesterday morning found themselves traversing Gisborne's first Rainbow Pride crossing. The colourful crossing was painted between cotton on kids and posty plus toes in Gladstone Road on Monday night. The Rainbow Pride crossing marks a partnership between Gisborne District Council and Tarafati Rainbow Collective. It has been installed to affirm and celebrate Tarafati's diverse rainbow communities, raise awareness about the discrimination and abuse rainbow people can experience, and signal that the Gisborne District Council is working towards creating a region that is safe, inclusive, and supportive of its diverse communities. For some, or for many, um, every day they experience abuse and discrimination, and we want to make people aware um, by having the rainbow crossing that um, these people are in our community and that we can all do something to make a difference. Gisborne Mayor Rehit Stoltz said, as a council they wanted to be inclusive for the diverse community. The Rainbow Pride Crossing was one step they could take to achieve that. Uh, we do fly the rainbow flag February in front of the council buildings and as always we support our rainbow community because Everyone in Tairawhiti to live, deserve to live the life um, that is good, that is wholesome and that's why we try to be um, supportive of diversity and inclusive. Race Relations Commissioner Meng Foon congratulated the Gisborne District Council and Tairawhiti Rainbow Collective for the initiative. As you know, um, it is a human right to be who you are and not to discriminate against anybody of race, colour, creed, gender religion and so this is a great uh, example of leadership um, right here in Gisborne, the first city in the world to see the sun and I know that it's only one of four um, so may we have some more. Gisborne District Council Journeys Operation Manager for Roading Donna McArthur said their team was a hundred percent behind the project. We just want to reiterate we're here for all our community we care for everybody and very, very proud of this moment. Community Youth Gisborne Chairperson and Gisborne Girls High School Year 11 student Henarata Kohere Peshev said the crossing was really cool because it helped make the LGBTQIA plus community feel supported and not alone. I think it's very monumental because um, it's, it's not just a colourful piece of road, it's a symbol and it's a sign and it's, yeah, it's representative of who we are. Tairafiti Diversity Liaison Officer and a founding member of Tairafiti Rainbow Action, Fiti Timutimu, said it took three years to get to this day. Our want was to have wider inclusivity of our rainbow communities. So this is one of many things that we are proactively promoting and doing as a little group of volunteers. Tairafati Police Area Commander Sam Eberama said as a member of Tairafati Rainbow Collective, he thought the partnership was awesome. It's all about whānau, you know, and, uh, and it's all about diversity and having a, such a diverse community uh, and accepting of our diverse community. It's, it's fantastic. So I think we've opened it up for future generations. You know, look at the generations. We've got four generations here today. And I think that speaks a lot in itself. 